How will you divide 720 divided by 45? So 720 divided by 45 can be written as 9 times 5. And now we are going to split that. 720 divided by 9 divided by 5. And now 720 divided by 9 is 80. 80 divided by 5 is just 16. That's your answer. 40 is what percent of 400? So just do 40 divided by 4. That gives you 10. So 40 is 10 percent of 400. So 80 is what percent of 500? So just take 80 divided by 5. That gives you 16. So 80 is 16 percent of 400. 63 is what percent of 900? So just take 63 divided by 9. That gives you 7. 63 is 7 percent of 900. How much is 7 times 8? So all you can do is 7 multiplied by 8 can be written as 10 minus 2. And you can multiply 7 with 10 and with 2. So 7 times 10 is 70 minus 7 times 2 is 14. 70 minus 14 is 56. And done. That's your answer. To convert a fraction to a percentage, we just make the denominator equal to 100. So we multiply 5 with a number to make it as 100. 5 times 20. So we multiply the same thing with the numerator. That's 4 times 20. So 4 times 20 gives us 80 and 5 times 20 gives us 100. So that's 80%. So 4 over 5 in percentage is 80%. So what is 1 fourth as a percentage? 4 factorial over 3 factorial to the 3 factorial. So let's write down what is 4 factorial. 4 factorial is basically 4 times 3 times 2 times 1. It goes on till 1. So 3 factorial is again, it starts from 3 and it goes on till 1. 3 times 2 times 1. And it's 4 factorial over 3 factorial. So let's divide both of them. So 3, 3 crosses out. 2, 2, 1, 1 crosses out. And you're left with 4. Now you have this to the 3 factorial. So let's write down 4 to the 3 factorial. That's equal to 4. 3 factorial is 3 times 2 times 1. And that's equal to 4 to the 6th. That's your answer. What is square root of 25% minus 5%? So let's convert the percent to decimal first. 25% as a decimal is 0 0.25. Now we're going to convert the decimal to fraction. So 0 0.25 as a fraction is 25 over 100. We have the square root. Now let's break them apart. So we have square root of 25 over square root of 100. And as we already know, square root of 25 is 5 and square root of 100 is 10. So 5 over 10 is 50% as a percentage. So let's subtract this 5%. So 50% minus 5% will give us 45% and you're done.